and welcome back to the Zach and Buzz Review. Review. Okay, so what have we brought in today besides cat? Well, I've got a Marcus. Look at this fluffy tabby Marcus. <laughs> She's come to visit, haven't you, Marcus? You have, right in She's the middle our, of the video. She's our co-host in the video. But uh, yeah, I brought something in today. Okay, cool. Let me just grab it. What have we got? Da, 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 da. Okay, Food. it's a box. It's a box on top of a cat. <laughs> what is it then? What is it? It's the Ryobi 18 volt high pressure inflator. Now, Ryobi, that's a familiar name. I think, if I am correct, we did a chainsaw review yes, on the we, Ryobi chainsaw. We did do the Ryobi chainsaw. So, so go you, check that out. If you haven't seen it, yeah, check that out. So I've been quite impressed with the Ryobi tool so far mm -hmm. that I've purchased. Yep. And uh, I've wanted a an easy way of nipping out and topping up my tires of my vehicles. Okay. Um, I've got... You know, you know those power packs you get for cars, the emergency power packs that you can do jump starts and everything. Oh, else what on. those those kind of big ones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got yeah. one of those that's got a built-in uh, inflator, mm -hmm. uh, but it takes forever to inflate the tyres. Right. You see? And uh, it sounds absolutely like a machine gun. So this is a solution. Yeah. So well, I was hoping it would be, because Ooh, this, okay. this 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 is this is to, to what we need to to find out. But uh, anyway, so this tyre inflator. $39.99 is what right. I paid for this. Okay, that's a good price. But that is the tool itself. Right. No battery. Okay? Ah, okay. No battery. So you've got, you've got to have your 18 volt battery to plug into that. So we already had the battery because of the chainsaw? Yeah, we've already got the battery because okay. the chainsaw. And I've got several batteries, as I say, I've got Ryobi drills and things anyway. Uh, anyway, this comes not only just the, the blank tool itself, but it also comes with uh, inflating uh, adapters okay so you can do other things apart from just doing car and bicycle tires you know you can do footballs and probably air beds and such like and there you go okay. so. it, it, it's designed to inflate things yes so let's check out should we get it out of the box yes so here it is out of the box that looks uh, funky it is uh, really light so you feel the weight of that there's nothing to it <laughs> I mean, if you if if you put presented this to me and I didn't know what it was, then I'd be really confused. You're abused. <laughs> uh, it's, I mean, it's very straightforward. It's got a trigger, uh, and it's got the pressure gauge. All oh, right. Okay. And the connector. Now, when I got out of the box, mm -hmm. my initial thing I thought was, oh, oh dear. Yeah. What is that rattle? It's got something that's loose inside. Say so rattly. Another. Oh dear. Yeah. You think, yeah, you, know, you think I've just bought something and it's rattling. Yeah. But it turns out what it has is just here, it's where the adapters are stored, just in the Oh, in this it's bit. like a little. And it's got bit. one of those, it's got a little, there's three adapters and one of them sits over the top of the other one. And it's that sort of rattling. Can so it's I, nothing. Can I see? Can I so see? Oh, yeah. So there's nothing, nothing wrong with this at all. So what we need to do is slap a battery in it. So that, that is part of the OnePlus system. Yeah, part of the OnePlus system, uh, and this is the 4AH 18 volt battery, which mm -hmm. also has the uh, level indicator on it. If you push that, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. This one at the moment is at three bars. You get four bars and three bars. So it's as simple as that. So you buy the tool itself, slap it in there. Now we're going to see what happens with. Our co-host. Oh, no, we're not inflating we're not, the cat. We're not inflating the cat. Oh, I'm just no. going to just going to pull the trigger. <laughs> Okay. Okay, so that's it. Oh, I mean, that's actually not too loud, is it? No. I was expecting it to be a bit more violent, but no, yeah. it isn't. It actually doesn't, it's no way as loud as that uh, one that I had on my battery pack. There we go. So I think what we need to do is mm -hmm. to uh, take it outside, which we already are, but take it out. Take to, it to a different outside so, location. And, and, and try it out on yes, one of the cars. Yes, that would be good. Should we do that? Yes, I think we should. Let's go. Okay, so here we are outside. Let's just try this little hand pump out. I'm really hoping that this is going to be a very quick and easy way to just top up the tyres. Of course, you can use it on all sorts of other things. There you go. Got that connected in. So yeah, we need to stick about 10 pounds in this tyre. Let's go for it. Actually, this isn't as loud as I was expecting it to be. Some of these small pumps are really loud and sound like a bit of a machine gun. And I'm pleased to say that this uh, is putting the pressure in really quite quickly. 
We're only up five pounds from where, when I started. If I use one of my other ones, a little portable one, like on a, a portable power unit that I carry around in the back of the car, it sounds like an absolute horrible machine gun and it takes ages to blow a tire up. And this is going really fast. We're virtually there now. And we're done. That was absolutely painless. Stick the dust cap back on. So that was the Ryobi high pressure inflator in action. Yeah, that was actually really cool. I was quite impressed by that. Yeah, um, I've got to say, it's so easy. I mean, literally, I just took this off the shelf, battery in it, take it to the car, and it pumps up rapidly mm. compared to the other mobile electric pumps or like got. a bicycle pump that we've been known to do because we're insane yeah yeah i mean i <laughs> don't get me wrong i don't mind a bit of exercise and yeah of i've got this big old bicycle pump for pumping but up the time convenience wise this is great this is this is and, just, and the price yeah. the price is really good 39.99 i mean the thing is the, the other options we have we live in the countryside the other options we have for pumping tires up um we do have a big compressor i've got a big compressor in my workshop but the thing is mm. it's it's way away from uh, where we park the vehicles of so course, yeah. it's not convenient to take a, co a compressor out and do that so this is a good price good price it's mobile it doesn't yeah. make that much noise it saves us the other thing which yeah. is the journey to the garage yeah and it's compact which is also good because the other thing you'd have to drive to our local garage and uh, use their yeah, very very lightweight tire pressure um, because it's, it's very mobile how much it costs at the garage it's about couple of quid it's, it's i think it's a pound yeah but for their machine limited and if, you're, time if you're not quick <laughs> especially on like a van or something yeah if you're not quick, if you're doing it by yourself you're not going to be able to because you have it. to like make sure you t tip is take the dust caps off first yeah and then you have to run around and try and pull the lead and it costs you a quid but if it runs out it's going to cost you two quid mm. um so 39.99 all of your inflating needs sorted all in one unit i like it good i think good. i think i think uh, try it try with the uh try the weight with the battery try it on the cap no no, no. try it on the cap but the weight with the battery yeah i like it i like it so i am impressed ryobi mm -hmm. another fantastic little tool to put in my armory <laughs> he has tools. got a shelf now by yeah. the way 39.99 i can highly recommend it real easy peasy limited unlimited what you can do with it if you've got uh, got kids and you've got loads of footballs and stuff like that footballs yeah, yeah. job done bikes, bikes stuff like that cars job done there you go what more can i say well would you recommend it i would recommend it very good there you go if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe to this channel and comment below any suggestions of further reviews you'd like to see see you in the next one